so you're getting very low marks in test series and you are very tensed and that's why you have clicked on this video to understand how can you uh, like improve quote very low max to very high marks so the first point is uh, that i want to say to you is like there is no particular hack or trick that will magically change your numbers from 20 number 20 to 60 okay i know you have seen many thumbnails like this you, like their test series score have gone from 20 to 60 you have seen many videos like this right but just the bottom line is there is no such trick and if you're looking for some trick right then you can drop this video because i will not say any tricks here okay there is simply no trick what is the single trick that will improve your marks from 20 simply study right because if you are getting very low marks in test series very low like i'm talking about only 20 percent marks right 20 percent or full number of 100 percent you're getting 20 percent that simply means you have not studied the subject in a good manner you might feel like i am telling few harsh things to you that how can you say something like this i have studied the subject sir okay but maybe not in a great manner maybe you have not solved enough questions maybe not enough pyqs so you have to do that you will have to solve enough pyqs you have to prepare the subjects in a good level then only we can talk about strategy strategy will come only after you have prepared the subjects in a good manner Otherwise, there is no use of strategy. You can use any strategy. You can look up internet. You can search chat GPT. You can do anything, right? There is no, no worth of that. And mostly people go for those videos, right? Mostly you also will go for the video that will show you that how can I improve from 20 plus to 50 plus. There is no way of that, right? Simply, you have to study. That is the first thing. You will have to focus on the concepts, what you have not covered. So that is the first thing. That's why you are not getting high enough marks okay now to coming back to the actual strategy strategy part maybe you are getting good enough marks like maybe 50 percent marks maybe you know you know the subjects right you have studied the subject in a good manner you know the concepts you were able to solve the questions after the test were over without seeing the solutions but during the test you are not able to solve it then that is a real problem that we will fix how you will fix so any problem right if you repeat it multiple times it will go away okay so not totally go away but you will be able to eliminate it in a good manner so the first thing is by giving more test series so initially you will get low marks there is no problem with that the first time once you will give a test right you will see that you have not performed good at all so that's totally fine but slowly if you attempt more and more test series slowly you will understand your body your brain you will understand which questions you can solve in the first round. So generally what I do is I solve questions in three rounds. Okay. First round is I see the question. I know how to solve the question. I will directly solve it. Okay. I know I basically I have solved that, that kind of question previously. So there is no risk attached to it. I know the concept behind it and I will solve it. Second type of questions would be that I, ha I have, I have, I have seen a question like this, right? But I also know the concept, but currently it is not totally clicking to me. How should I approach the question? Then what you can do mark for review. Okay. Mark it for review and you will solve it in the round two because trust me, once your round one is over, right? Your brain is in a good state. It is all, it has already solved many questions. So if you come back to that question in round two, you will feel like you are able to solve that particular question because already your brain was up and running and it will click trust me it will click if you have solved a question previously like that it will click on your brain okay if it does not click that's fine again you mark it for you again you iterate through other questions so that's how i used to, i used to solve simply if i know the solution of the question i will solve it otherwise there if there is some uh, if also if i know the solution of the question right but it seems like it will be lengthy now you will say, sir, how will I know that it will be lengthy? How will I know that I, I, I will have to mark for review? That is the, that is the point one. That's why I told you the point one first. The more you attempt test series, more you will be accustomed with it and more uh, comfortable you will be which one to mark for review, which one to solve at that point of time. That will be depending on yourself. So there is no generic, like there is a generic strategy, but you have to iterate the strategy with yourself 
okay that's why uh, all the rankers everyone will say they have attended attended test series right and of course all the rankers there is multiple youtube videos now everyone knows everyone strategy but all of them are not like everyone will not be able to get ir1 why because you can know all the strategy because right now this age is of technology so you have chat gpt you can get any information any knowledge that you like in your hands but still getting rank 1 right is something else you will have to work hard for that just knowing the information is not enough you will have to apply it the moment you start applying then you realize you will tailor the strategy according to you because everyone is different everyone is not the same okay and uh, regarding one more thing of test series speed accuracy there is always this balance between speed and accuracy which one shall i choose first speed or accuracy so what i suggest to most people is focus on accuracy first okay because at least you want to solve the question right if you know the concept you want to solve the question in a good manner uh, in a slow manner because initially you don't need to worry about the speed because gate is not the a exam of speed you know it right gate is not an exam of speed because you get 3 minutes for each question if you see any other competitive examination you will get bit lower time compared to gate so that's fine speed will come how it will come again with practice so focus on accuracy speed will automatically come the most important part that i want to tell if you are getting low marks in test series or average marks you have to analyze it simply go and see which questions you were not able to solve what was what was the reason for it was time the reason if time is the reason then it's fine then it's fine you can just uh, bookmark that question or maybe note down that question it took me more time i was not able to solve it i know the concept you are able to solve it without seeing the solution then there is no problem time speed will come with more practice but if you have enough time and still you are not able to solve a particular question that means there is a problem of concept either you did not knew the concept or you have forgotten that concept or you did not study that concept there can be three things so for these three things there is only one solution revision okay so you can obviously revise through my rpyq videos or you can uh revise through any other crash course or you, you can revise through your, your notes or you can revise through your pyq course there are many ways to revise obviously there is a video revision strategy you can search revision strategy you will get that video so you can revise through that so that's it so one more thing if your marks are not improving at all as i mentioned during the starting of the video simply you have to study in a good manner okay you might might have skipped few important concepts you might have not solved the pyqs that is the reason that's why your uh, your marks are not improving at all even after applying all the strategy because strategy will not help you ultimately concepts will help you to solve a question and strategy just refines the uh refines your output so previously if you are getting 60 marks now you will get 70 marks there can be a delta of 10 marks but there cannot be a delta of 50 marks 30 marks okay the 30 marks delta will only come with clearing of concepts so that's it for this video if you did enjoy this video hit the like button and if you want to know uh, any strategy if you want to know any strategy regarding any other topic regarding gate or any other thing always put it down in the comments below we are always there to help you guys so i will see you in the next video until then happy learning